we are back from Norway, back to London. Okay, it's Sunday here in London and we are just heading out now for a walk. I'm gonna do like 10,000 steps, Matt's getting my jacket on me. I think I'm not gonna wear that. You're not wearing this, no. it's quite cold. Okay. okay, take us out, babe. Umbrella, I think we'll be okay with one or should we take yeah, two? Yeah, take one. Yeah, I'm taking one. <laughs> I'm just wondering about two. Good morning, London. So I recently did an eye test and I need glasses. Well, I've known that for a few years, but I've never got them. So I'm just gonna try some on. They're over there, by the way. <laughs> yeah. Okay, yes. Yes, sir. Yeah, I like them. Mm. Ooh, stylish. Just in Nike, having a look around. And I've just finished reading Shoe Dog by Phil Knight. Just been to Mac. Just in third space getting a protein shake. Sam, cheers. Matt wants the art piece with the girl in her boobs. He's not even saying no. Wow. Still not saying no. Going in art galleries is one of our favourite things to do, right? We're so excited to buy art. Yeah, that's smart. Okay, Matt's just going to try on some sunglasses. Just look at me. Hi, you can see me. <laughs> what does everyone think to these? It's a yes from me. These and these for me, so just let me know which you prefer. I'm 50-50. I really like them. Yes. Except I'll probably never wear them. Matt has made a purchase. Have Thank you. Day. Where are we now? Covent Garden. Okay, we found Blondie's Kitchen. What have we got here? Oh, wow. We'd like to get <gasps> all of your stock, please. <laughs> uh, probably for me, it's going to be. What's that one called? Oh, it's got banana in it. This is in. called the Kinder Bueno Cookie Kinder Slice. Bueno so it has slice. Uh, bueno cream inside mm -hmm. and milk chocolate chips. Yeah, can we go for one of these? Looking out of the yes, please. Thank you. Is this your store? No, no, I just bought it. Yeah, it's my place to work. Yeah, it is. You get to try the stock. <laughs> I think I've tried almost all of them now. <laughs> That's well, you look, dangerous. I just recently started working. Having a look at the Rolexes. Thinking of getting two Rolexes soon, aren't we, Matt? Yeah, two each. We've never bought anything like that before. We've only really bought. It's time to diversify our investments. Yeah, diversify. we telling ourselves. <laughs> okay, we've just finished our shopping trip. I think we're a bit shocked out now. So we're gonna head back to our apartment. How many steps have we done? We've done. Hopefully 20,000. 5,000, so far 5,000 walk back. Is that it? And that, I thought we've done way more than that. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh yeah, mostly okay. shopping. Mostly shopping trip. Matt's going makeup shopping. Yes, this is one of my favourite stores. It's really glossy. <laughs> wow, that's a nice store. So I've retreated to the bench where the men hang out while the women shop. <laughs> nice. Thank you. That's nice. Okay, we're gonna give you a quick haul on what we got today. So Matt got some Kiehl's face wash. Then from Space NK, I got some Olaplex dry shampoo. This is really good. Just while you're carrying on, okay. I know that artwork is super weird. Yeah, this isn't our apartment. This place. isn't our furniture, so. Yeah, this just... is not our furniture. Because <laughs> we were in an art store earlier, like yeah. looking at art, and I thought maybe people are watching this thinking Absolutely. that's our taste. That might be someone's taste. There's nothing yeah. wrong with it. Oh, it's very individual. This is a furnished rental, so if yes. you're on the furniture. <laughs> I got some K18 conditioner. 
I actually have the shampoos and the hair mask from that brand, which is really good. Then I got some face tanning drops from Tan Lux. You just mix these in with your moisturizer and you basically go on holiday overnight. <laughs> <laughs> then I got a Glossier uh, bronzing paint in the color Dune. This is really nice. And that experience was very unique. Every time yes. we go into a business, I'm always observing what they do and what their sales process looks like. So tell us about that. So there's basically like girls who work for Glossier on the shop floor and you there's only testers on the thing to look at and you have to go up to a girl and say, this is the product I want. And they go, okay, you check out, you pay for it. And then you go into this waiting room where they basically package the orders and then give you a bag. But it comes out on a conveyor belt. It comes out on like a conveyor belt. With your name belt. on. Yeah, with a name on. But there's no like pricing information in the store. You can't pick no. up any I items. Mean, there's, there's prices on the products. Oh, is there? But it's like there's loads of girls around the shop. And you just go up to them and be like, I'm ready to check out. Mm. Like it's not like a queue and you order. It's, yeah. Yeah, it's a really nice building. So if you're bored, go to their Coral Garden. <laughs> then I got a blush from MAC. Shade Gingerly. The makeup lovers. Then I've got a touch of moisturizer. This is such a good moisturizer, except I've only tried the purple one before, so I'm trying this blue one out called the Water Cream. We also met Neil and Natalie in Space and K, who are subscribers of the channel. <laughs> Love meeting you guys, because sometimes I forget people even watch these videos. <laughs> <laughs> that was cool. Uh, Prep and Prime highlighter in the shade Peach Luster. This is for under eyes. Matt's looking at me like, what the hell is that? It's to color correct for the dark circles that we get from working all the time. Okay, onto Matt's purchases. He actually spent more money than me today. Woo! <laughs> on less items. On less items, because Matt's all about quality. Okay, I'll do the unboxing. Do you want to unbox this one? No, you can unbox them for me. So, Prada. Wow. Ooh! <laughs> Shall I try them on for everyone? Yeah. See if I suit them, then we can share. Can we now? So this is the vibe. Ready? I'm not gonna ruin them. How do they look? Yeah, it still works. <laughs> Looks good. Can't really see. So yeah, I like them. I like them especially now seeing them on you. Oh, and guys, I also bought some normal glasses today because I actually have to have prescription glasses. So I'll show you them when I pick them up in five to 10 business working days. Five to 10 <laughs> business working days. <laughs> well, that's what they said. Yeah. Oh, and then Matt also got upsold onto the sunglass cleaning spray and screwdriver. Which again, I just embraced. Again, always studying the sales process and often the upsell is key. Best thing we bought today is this Kinder Bueno mm. Blondie from Blondie's Kitchen. There's one in Selfridges and Covent Garden. I've got a sweat on. Is there actually one in Selfridges or was it a different yeah. company that yeah. had a similar? Blondie's Kitchen. Blondie's Kitchen. Cookie. I'm going to put this in the microwave for 30 seconds, the guy said. Yeah. That was a good haul. It was a fun day and we got around 10,000 steps walking around. Yeah. So that means we can eat about a quarter of that cookie. We've got Farmer J's coming. Yeah. This is like our UK Air One. If you mm. have Air One, that really expensive supermarket. That's so incredible. good. Farmer Farm J's is good too though. I really like it. Yeah. Probably one of the favorite London spots for me. If you like health, healthy food, but need something fast and you know, eat it, it's a good option. It's good quality. Option. Good yeah. quality. It's really good. Okay, bye. Finish the run. Where are you? Here you are. That was good. Yeah, so good. Right around Regent's Park, about 30 minutes or so. We're hosting the Luxury Property Partners training day today, actually. So, let's go. We've just finished the LPP training day. Really good day. Lots of our agents. Very busy. Great day. Yeah. What have you just bought? So, we bought some new sourdough and some other little bits. But it's a rainy day, so classic London day here. We do have the umbrella, though. Let's put that up. There we go. Where are we off to next? Down here to get my glasses. Oh uh, yeah. Remember I tried some glasses on? Anyway, we haven't picked the vlog camera up in a few days. We have been to two shoots for the Luxury Home Show. I went to a house in Bromley and then we went to Sully Hall in Birmingham. Sully Hall. I think Sully Hall. Sully yeah. Hall. To see Birmingham. two new builds with an old client of Luxury Home Show. Yeah. HCD development. So 
They'll be coming out soon. That was a cool project. Mm -hmm. We're back in London now and Got to be careful my phone doesn't get nicked out my hand because there's a lot of robbers in yeah, London. We've seen that. We've no. witnessed, guys, robberies. Oh my God, it feels, feels weird. Oh, this is what they look like. Okay, so this is what they look like. I'm just going out to a few things. Oh, breath coming up the stairs. <laughs> okay, we are still looking to buy somewhere, but we don't look so far. Okay, we're just heading off to our viewing now. Beautiful day here in London. <laughs> what were you going to say? Mm -hmm. Oh, exactly say? that. Yeah, so we're going to the viewing. Matt's getting nervous vlogging in public. <laughs> I'm not getting nervous. I'm just making sure we go the right way. It's left. Do you have him? Over there. Okay. We're viewing now. So we're currently staying in, we're renting an apartment here and we are looking to buy one. But yeah. So we're living on the ground and low ground floor is a duplex. We're looking for something on the first floor. Yeah, we're looking for, guys, first floor is criteria must. This one is a second floor actually, <laughs> Ooh, but no, okay. it's on one yeah. of my favorite streets. Yeah. So, yeah, still no, worth viewing. We, we are open. We're really about just finding the right seller, who's in the right position and- The right property. Right property, um, yeah. A lot of these are leaseholds, so the right type of leasehold or share of freehold is something we're looking at. Um, we never did an update on our last property investment and yeah. That was because we were in Australia, but it's rented out now, so. That's why we couldn't get in and get show in. you guys around. We're giving them their peace to live in it like it's their home. Yeah. But yeah, we'll show you more of what we're up to in a moment. We have a dog with a coat on. It's a bit cold, isn't it? Yeah. But the sun is starting to come out, I guess. All right, just got back in from my walk. I'm having some nice avocado on sourdough. I just Ooh. went to um, Bailey and Sage to get the sourdough and oh, it's gotta be some of the best sourdough I've ever had. It's a close second, I think, to Harris Farm on the Gold Coast in Australia. The sourdough there was delicious. Do love a good sourdough. I've gone for pesto on top this time as well. So it's like mm. pesto and avo, which might sound weird, but it does work. Matt's a good cook. Mm, yeah, it's pretty simple. Yes, you are. Just a few, a few little touches. <laughs> and then like all of the eggs in the whole pack for the protein. So <laughs> we're gonna get on with some work now. It's Friday, isn't it? It's like Easter weekend, yeah. bank holiday. So maybe we'll do some Easter shopping in the next vlog. How's your week been, Matt? How's my week been? Mm -hmm. My week has been good, actually. It's been productive. It's been a good week all round. So enjoying life here, living in London and going around Regent's Park. At Oxford Street being, what, a minute away? It's pretty cool. Um, and then for the Luxury Home Show, it's been a busy quarter, really good and pretty pleased with how everything's going. So we have officially got a new Luxury Home Show website, which we're excited about. That should help us connect with more homeowners and allow us to continue our mission of what we're doing. And in other exciting news, we have a, another full-time starter joining us um, mm -hmm. in April, Gemma, that'll be exciting. And in the next quarter, we're looking to hire two more people full-time for the Luxury Home Show business. Um, a full-time videographer to help us out with a um, another like series or concept we want to do with the channel which we won't reveal too much about yet but you should hopefully see soon if you follow that channel too and then a full-time outreach manager for like specific partnerships that we're looking to build on so 
That's a lot of what we're working on behind the scenes. Um, Summer, how has your week been? Yeah, good, thank you. Yeah. I'm reading this book at the minute. It's really good. Who, not how. Recommend anybody? This is Tom Hopkins, How to Master Selling. I've actually read this all the way through once, but like it says on the cover, it is one of the best books on sales. Highly recommend it if you are in sales. Got this one. Yeah. And then you also bought the, is this the autobiography from the Netflix yeah. guy? This was funny though. So of course you can see who's the author or who's this book about. Um, I added it to our basket on Amazon and then I think I got distracted with another task and I got an email from Amazon like, oh, we think you left something in your basket and it was like, oh, it's Jeff emailing me himself. <laughs> but I think this is where we're going to wrap up the vlog because it's coming up to Easter weekend and we'll probably start a new video where we'll spend the weekend here just hanging out, doing some fun stuff and we'll pick it up from there. But thanks for watching. Subscribe Bye. so you can see what's coming up next. Nails. <laughs> see ya.